What do you have to offer for a partnership? For a partnership? Wow. Mm-hmm. I have everything Oof. to offer. Like, what? If you if you have a business, I'm investing. If you want to throw this, I'm planning. If you want to do this, like, I feel like I have enough skills and I feel like I get my money and I know how to, like, maintain it if you if you pitch in something. So it's like I'm your investor, your shareholder, your organizer, your plan. Like, I'm all of these Are things Are you emotionally wait, wait. stable? Before we, before emotionally we... stable? I would say, <laughs> no, yeah, I have my bad days. But Crazy. overall, like, yeah, if, we, if, we, plan, if no. we have a goal and we get in somewhere and we're, like, building towards this, like, and you taking direction or I'm taking direction and you're following so or I'm following Sue, then I'm all in. Like, it's emotional what? When a man says, I, this is what, that's the type of woman that they like, how are y'all trying to dictate or, 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 or get, upset. Think, get upset because you have men like, you know what? I, that's the woman I would deal with. Nobody said anything wrong with that. I mean, obviously, I'm not going to say absolutely, like, I'm 100% perfect. Obviously, there's my emotional, like, flaws that can you know, eat at somebody else's whatever they got going on. So you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Every woman's no, a little crazy. Like, what is, what is, like, your, what is your temperament? I'm joking, yo. Are you good with kids? Are you scared yes. of dogs? Yeah, like, these are things you got to think about when you're dealing with somebody and you're talking about partnership. What if this person have a dog? What if this person have kids already? Are you good with kids? Yeah, I'm That's adaptable. I, I can adjust. Adaptable. Like, I'm very, like, I've traveled a lot. I've moved around a lot. I'm and not maybe, in the same, so. Yo, Crystal, uh, I get what you're saying. Nikki don't want to accept it, but I get it's, it. It's not Listen. that because. No, I don't want anybody in a relationship saying they could adjust. You are an individual. If you have to adjust too much in a relationship, you no longer become an That's individual. Not, so can true. I say something real That's quick on that? Yeah, 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 yeah. You, yeah. Yeah. Maybe you need to adjust, Nikki. The biggest room in the house no. is room for improvement. Yeah, so yeah, yeah, at absolutely. The, at the end of the day, like, you you always need to adjust. Yes. New knowledge come on the planet every single day. If you still stuck on who you were yesterday and you're not adjusting to the time, then you stuck in a time warp. You need to always constantly evolving. So you need to adjust. You need to adapt. So the person in order to make things it's work. It's not always going to be the same person. I'm not always going to be the same, same person. Same person. Right? 100%. You know, I can, we supposed to live 100 years. Like, you think I'm going to be this person for 100 years? No. I mean, growing and adjusting is different. If that camera is crooked right there, he could adjust it. But if it's broken, it's still going to be broken, yeah. whether he okay. adjusted or not. Yeah. You understand? Yeah, no, so, so and, that's it. and let me, oh, and I agree oh, wait, with wait, that. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, wait, wait. Excuse me. How okay. did that go with to, the toxic to the masculinity? Yeah, okay. Yeah, I get out of here. Um, Don't call masculinity toxic. <laughs> Don't do that. That's I great. said with the toxic, okay? The thing is, when we say adjust, like I said, you could be broken, but you could adjust to a situation. I don't want nobody to adjust to me. I want to grow with, with you. Well, it's not broken. It's, like, it. it's just bending. If the relationship is bending in a way, like, but we don't straighten When we it talk together. about healthy relationships, a lot of y'all don't even, a lot of us don't know what healthy relationships are. When you start to lose yourself as an individual, what that I, mean, I feel like that's, that's unhealthy in no, a relationship. No, I understand what you're saying. So I'm not you saying... can't be with somebody and totally adjust yourself or remove yourself from your previous life. You need to have your own life outside of the relationship. So if you got to adjust too much, now, like, exactly. it's Can I just oh. emotionally, like, I'm going to adjust for my man emotionally because you have to. When men are supposed to go out in the world and be this person and be strong and be this. So I'm going to adjust be like, baby, it's okay. Like, you can talk to me. You could tell me what else you're going through. You could tell me this. So I'm going to address emotionally. And I know myself, like, I, think you got, I can be um, very... Adjustment and supportiveness, probably. No, because no. that adjustment... Be no, you're not... All right, listen, listen. Can I just speak real quick? I'm just I, trying to and I got to say something after you. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to say it. I'm going to throw it to Jada. Mm-hmm. What I'm hearing, Rico is hearing, is that she is going to do what is ever necessary to make the relationship work. So she's willing to adjust, right? She's not committed to her. She's not committed to him. She's committed to what the relationship is. If right now for five years, I need her to do X, Y, and Z, she's going to do X, Y, and Z. If five years later, it's I need, not I need her to do- run. Yeah, I'm yeah. not gonna lose myself Obviously, in the yeah, long run. We're not gonna say complimenting morality, right? But yeah, you're right. So now let's say I need her to do A, B, and C, which is the total opposite ex, uh, spectrum. She's going to adjust to make sure it works so that we both could work and go in the right direction. And I feel like, I like this because a lot of times, even myself, I'd be so stuck in what I what I want to do and how I have to move that if I I could lose out on somebody great because I don't want to take a different step, and that's the problem. So you, I think and you gotta learn how. And so Maybe the man, you turn. gotta learn so how to adjust. Let me come in. Let me come in. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. So because 
you know, I know a lot of people don't believe in signs, but because she's my Scorpio sister, <laughs> I'm gonna just tell y'all this. We're basically women who are submissive, but we're not one to play with. So we know what we want, if we're interested in you, if you intrigue us, if you do what you're supposed to do, we're going to be that woman, period. We can do, if if being there for you and being a good woman for you is gonna help us get to where we need to go in the end, that's gonna work for us. But if you play around and you don't, you don't have certain things that we desire, then it's just, we're just gonna leave the situation, period. But submissive is very important in a woman. And it's been so hard on women, especially black women, that a lot of us don't know how to be submissive mm -hmm. and we don't know how to cater to a man. That's and right. we're not ready to make changes in order to make things work. And that's just how, you know, shit is sabotaged. But you have to be able to say, all right, we have a child. Now I have to be home. Like, I'm just speaking from my situation now. <laughs> I just had a child. So now my life is different. I can't just go out and party and go to dinners with him and do this and do that. I have to stay at home and make sure our child is good while he goes goes out and he works. And as emotional as I was in the beginning, because I was frustrated, I had to realize, all right, he's at work because he has an end goal for an end goal for us. And I'm here making sure that our child is good so that eventually we can come to a meeting point and we can, our lives can make another, you know, change so that we can adjust to it. So it's kind of like, Shit just got to work out. And, and I, you know, that's dope. I, and mind you, I don't think that is just a Scorpio thing. I just think that's just a woman in general. I <laughs> and think, well, I think and adjusting that that's like two different things for me. So I just want to clear yeah, that but, up. But it's sum not like submissive the same thing. doesn't mean oppression. A lot of times people, you try to use that in the same thing because you could be submissive and that doesn't mean that you a pushover. People, we have, you know, we get caught up on words and we are trained to think that submission is you, you're a pushover. That's not what this is. So uh, we both, the woman, as you say, needs to adjust and the man has to adjust to the time. We're both evolving and learning. It's a journey to learning or getting to self-actualization to your true potential. So you still learning yourself. She's still learning herself and y'all adjusting to the time to what, as Rico said, or what I heard, what Crystal and then now, Jada was saying, and I think that you agreed that, to this point a little bit as well, as in, uh, <laughs> as you, no, you give me the look, but I think that trying to do or compromise, is that's really the term, compromise to do what's best for the relationship. As long as it's not destroying you as a, in, as a person, then I think that compromising, and sometimes it hurts. Some, sometimes it does hurt. We, nothing is peachy peachy. Right. Everybody want things to be so peachy peachy and that's Same. just not reality. You know, trying to have a healthy standpoint. Uh, you were saying Scorpio women, we ride five men. Like, yeah, <laughs> that's cool. I feel like a lot of reason why, and not you, because I see how you doing, you've been doing without, you know, your previous relationships before you've been doing what you needed to do. A lot of women don't have much going on. And I'm not saying going like, you know, she probably work a regular job. So when you see a man like Ra or Rico, people that have men that have big dreams, you want to kind of like ride the coattail and you're going to invest a lot of yourself and what he got going on. That's true. And I feel like in a relationship that's unhealthy because that's his thing. It's not your thing and you're not happy. So you're trying to ride on his coattail thinking that's going to make you happy by making him happy. Well, and I, I don't know if that's like subbing me, but like for me, I'm not. <laughs> no, I, I'm just saying. Like, I'm not trying to play that. Oh, oh, oh. No, no you said, you pointed her, you pointed her out. You said, I know her, and, but you don't no, know me. Baby, so no, no, like, no, no, I can understand saying, why you know. I like this. I'm just, I'm just saying. Like, no, I'm not. On your, on your I, I don't. All I'm saying is, I know what I, I don't, bring. I, I know don't, what I'm I don't to know do. you. So like, but I know her, but, and I know she had a business that was doing right, her own thing and I before. That. But some women, and that's why I said. She said it's a Scorpio thing, but most women, and I'm not saying no, this. No, I know, but it was just yeah. two Scorpios right here that was talking about it, so that's why I just said it. You <laughs> yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not, no, I'm not even trying to, like, do anything. I'm just saying, like, for me to speak for myself as the other Scorpio woman sitting on the couch, Honey, like, I'm not, like, I'm not just going to ride my man's coattail. I'm going to believe in his dreams, and I have my own dreams as well. One lesson at this table, if there's five. an envelope and your name is not on it, do not open it. Because if I didn't say specifically you, I don't know you to say, you know, that's right. your thing. And no, and that's what I'm saying really trying to relationships we can't always like a woman we can't always see a man that's doing good and stop what we doing and 
go up under him. Because right. a lot of women do that. But I you know, and I that's, know, that's, that's, that's why I said my standard that too, of though. getting in a relationship, like yeah. I'm like very nervous and hesitant about it because I know how I am in a relationship. But, so it's like we just dating, like I'm gonna contribute and add, but I'm not gonna fully like be with that being word. said, your but standards you, also have to be high though. But, because right. if I'm contributing to you and if I'm doing this and doing that, you're not gonna cheat on me. You're not gonna disrespect me in any kind of way. You're gonna know that we have that's marriage coming up, yeah, right? That, I'm or saying, we have this come That's like, the negatives. That's the negatives. But look, you know what I'm I, just saying, you know what I don't like though the shaming, right? Sometimes some women don't have, as you said, doesn't have direction, but her direction, it makes her feel good of helping others, like helping her men. Sometimes what he wants is con like for instance, y'all both can do something as a team. You is that losing yourself? You talking to me? Yeah, I'm talking to you directly. Because I, I was, I felt like I was very specific on women yeah, that don't yeah. got much going on. So I, I wasn't talking about uh, women that actually is going in the to same college field doesn't mean that you got much going on. Um, that, what standard are we talking about, though? Yeah. I just want to say what I think, right? Because I think there's two ways to be a smart woman, mm -hmm. a woman, a smart woman, right? There's two ways, right? You could be one, be a smart woman by helping build your man because you don't want to work. So if you build your man, nobody wants to work. Not but just if women. she's married to you, she's fucked. Cause she's Listen not getting to high. me. I didn't, <laughs> no, I, yo, but no, no, no. If she's married to me and did the bare minimum, she's not getting half. Yes, that's 100% right. But like I was saying, if you are a smart, there's two ways to be a smart woman. If you help your man build everything, right? Build the empire. You don't have to worry about working once that empire is built. You don't have to worry about stressing or any type of financial stress about once that empire is built. That's one way to be a smart woman. We can't knock them. There's another way to be a smart woman. You can finesse your, the men that come into your life constantly and take from him, take from him, take from him, take from him, just so you can build yourself to the top. But there's, there's two ways and neither of them are wrong. Well, well actually, I'm gonna say one of them is wrong. I'm gonna say one of them is wrong, but I don't want to put a judgment. Is, is the other yeah, but, third. <laughs> but a woman who <laughs> builds her own and listen, mm -hmm. there's nobody and 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 nobody. There's nobody that themselves. builds their own without supporting cast. And I don't really care if you're a woman or a man. You need That's other right. pieces to the puzzle That's that right. put you in the position to to utilize that opportunity That's that right. you have today. No such thing so if you're a woman like, and you're at a CEO, guess what? There might have been a woman or a man that helped you put yourself in that CEO position. Right. At the end of the day, you still needed other people, but that's the same person who believed in one dream and focused on one building and pushed it to the top until they got to the position that they needed to get to. Mm -hmm. Now, we can't shame those people. I don't like when women shame other women, women. for helping their man. When I in agree. history, that has been what has been going on. And that woman has typically ate better than women who tried to utilize man as an opportunistic goal and and not i gotta preface this because i don't want this I'm is not this is not a shot at nikki this is not a shot at nikki about, listen, oh, but this, like, listen, no, but a listen no but listen no listen no because you know what i'm talking about no you women not, aren't building women today are not helping men build empire you just said if you just said if a woman help you build your empire you're gonna sit there and look back at your checkbook like oh you worked 10 hours that's not what i said that's what you said no, no, no. What I said, and I speak very clear, we're not slow here, and okay, we have footage. So, like, guys, be careful. That you I played. said, she said, if I worked as a call center for one year, then you're going to get paid for a call representative for one year. $12.50 or something? Uh, whatever so it may what be. Does a woman the need the no minimum tax, is no different. So, let me ask you, no what tip? does a woman need to do to build your empire now? You're a music artist, you're an actor. Right? What, what does I, she need? What does so, she what need I, to do? okay. In the video she I was about to say, just a point blank. So, so the audience, I know how this probably going to look. Just to be clear, Rico, if you were a woman, right, and you, you have a child, say you got three ch children by this woman, y'all been married for 10 years, and y'all get a divorce, would you give, or, or do you believe that you need to take care of that woman after y'all get a divorce? As long as my kids live with her. Okay. All right. So if my so, kids do not live with her, no, I, I don't need to take care of it. No grown adult. All right. So just to be clear, because women, a grown adult that has your because kids, because a lot of no, no, no. As long as my the kids, kids live lives with her, with yeah, her. Uh, she doesn't have my kids. kids. They don't live. No, with her. No, I know what you're saying. Yeah. So, wait, so, so, so he's not saying he's leaving a woman. So I just want I to make that clear yeah. because I know how it's gonna how it's gonna look <laughs> on my boy. He's <laughs> not leaving a woman scot dry. A woman that's dead that has his children. I don't gotta say things. Listen, I don't listen. I let the I let the people I know I let the people who can comprehend explain mm -hmm. but I don't have to explain everything I don't have That's we right. don't even have that much time on the segment so Rashawn yes. as Thank a man you.
Right? You're not on the show. It's me. It's me. You you watching online like everybody else. Okay. But you my man. Mm-hmm. Can you be submissive to me? I'd be like, Rashawn, I want to I wanna have the kids. You want to stay home with the kids. Well, I'll go get this bag. You could be submissive? Depending on what you're talking about, though. What do you, I'm yeah. very straightforward. Right. I'm working. I'm working. I'm building my empire, but I want you as my support. Like, so, okay. so you talking about Rashawn at this point in time in my life. <laughs> right? I'm, at, no, I'm, Go I'm going to answer. I just need, because you ahead. gave me, I need all the context. So Rashawn, yeah. at this point in time of his life, You're not on this show, I stay at home dad. Stay at home dad. No, ma'am. That's just never going to happen. Okay. Not at this time of my life. If I accomplish my goals, I don't mind help. I don't mind elev- helping and elevating my woman for her own goals and her dreams and admirations that she wants. And I'm not doing nothing. It's not in me, Nikki, to just <laughs> not do nothing. I'm not going to hold okay. you. And when I say not do nothing, I'm saying just stay at home. No, but man. you are doing something. You're raising the kids. You're cooking the meals. You're making sure the house is clean. You're making sure <laughs> the car is fixed. You're making sure the gutters Be are clean. You're making sure the lawn is mowed. I don't you understand? You making sure like you're still taking me out on dates. You making sure the girls is good. Their homework is done. Instead of me hiring a sitter and you're working and we gotta hire somebody to pick up the kids and hire somebody to wash the kids and do all this other hmm. stuff, you're there. <laughs> it's not in my nature. You didn't have to say none of that. Right. He just was like, nah, it's a no for me. It's a no for. And that, I, I, I'm not no. No judgment to any man that want to be a stay-at-home dad. Cool. Rico. But for me, Yo, that's just not in me. Rico, come here. At first, Rico. I, I, Rico. I, I, Rico. 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 You could be Riri. Rico. 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 Stop it. Rico. You could be my house husband. <laughs> not my house husband. First of all, look. This is what I be trying to talk about, though. She be exaggerating feelings <laughs> to get guys to do what they want to do. do. <laughs> you know, I... Go full I, circle. <laughs> you know, I'm going to say right now I can't answer the question. Right? <laughs> I, I, Stop the cat, bro. No, no, no. Because, look, my initial egotistical prideful self would say, fuck no. Right? Right? But, but rationally? The, but when I started <laughs> thinking about it, and I'm like, yo, well, I was right. struggling for 26 years in this world. <laughs> you need a break. It should be easier. <laughs> I actually might do it. Like, you know, like, so I would have to say, It'll right. It'll be a different lifestyle, you understand? It doesn't mean it's a bad thing. But, no one's saying you can never do anything for you. You can have an online business or whatever, but I'm saying I need your support. Well, I have online I business need you, too, so Right, I need you home. I need you with these girls. I need you to pick them but up. I need the you to do their homework. So, like, so when we say submissive, I say, like, we're, that I'm taking a, wait wait I'm yeah I'm taking submissive and I'm not putting at home there right? Yeah, right because submissive just means you're dedicating your vision to somebody else right 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 that's that's, that's how I kind of that's how I kind of put it like you're putting their vision you're submitting to their vision right right that's the best way I could put it so if I had to stay at home no I can do it. there's no way I can't even stay in my home stay at home okay so boom I'm a music artist. And I'm like, Rico, I don't want you to write. You're going to be on you. you're gonna be on tour with me. I've never Oh, we you. lit. What do you mean? You never uh, oh, no, I'm listen, with you. Listen to the question. I'm a music artist. Or I'm an actress. Um, mm, don't get an apartment. You're staying in LA with me for six months while I shoot this movie. But that's not submissive, though. It is submissive because as a man, you have to drop everything you're doing and but, come help me like, with look, my stuff. But look, six months? Mm-hmm. All right, so look. I believe that's everybody. I think, I'm getting money out there. I'm yeah, with you. Say, <laughs> you know, listen, I'm not, yeah, you're like, not gonna stop me from making money. I'm going to do yeah. what I need to do. You say, right? What, what we're if going money to is not the object, you guys? What if I just have you know enough? Why? Because like, I never. I, I, so I was raised and taught that a man that can't er, make or earn his own money. A woman would never truly really, really respect that's her. That's true. And that's so I think that's that. So for me, yeah, you know what? I can't so, do it. so for me, <laughs> so for me, I think that I, you can be with the woman all you want and say, "Babe, you gonna go ahead and you know she's at the top tier, and that's cool." And you don't do nothing for self. I don't think that woman, in my humbly opinion, will respect that man. Would you? 